My OnlyFans, it's been a minute. Peace be upon you. I've missed you guys. Um, I'm, I'm a changed man. I've passed my boards. I've, I've beat the final bosses. Now I'm here. Now I'm here for you guys. And I'm ready to provide you with the greatest playthrough. Oh, frick. Oh, frick. The greatest playthrough of this game ever made. Are you ready for me? Are you ready for me? Let's do, let's do infidelity. Uh, oh, continue. To celebrate, I have, uh, I'm going to be playing the Harry Potter theme, bass boosted, for the next couple of minutes. Let's do it! Let's go! He's kind of hot. Well, what do I do? Do I? It's a, uh, it's the Harry Potter theme, ear rape. Um, well, do I try to make the ugliest character possible? Make you darker. We gotta make you darker. I want glasses. Hey! Alright, I think that's enough. Oh yeah, I gotta give him a beard first of all so that he doesn't look like a woman. Oh, 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 that's hot. That's hot.
Uh, if I were Bilal, I would go here, but... Uh... A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing uh -huh. to be concerned about. Huh? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. I want to give you a wedgie. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be. I'm eager to get dogs. That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really a few. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Okay, that's better. That's better. Uh, hey, I want a beard. I can't. I, I can't not have a beard. I need a beard. I'm not, I'm not okay with this no beard thing. Shanks type car. I can't even change my eye color. Can I? Oh, I can. I'm tripping. I don't know which one looks more like my eyes. No, I don't think mine's are this light. I think this is right. Bro, he's like a... He's like a 50 year at Hogwarts. A 50 year at Hogwarts, you're like... Aren't you like... In your older teens at that point? I can't, I can't give him long hair and no beard. It's just, that's not gonna work. You kind of look like Lucius Malfoy here, it's cold. Oh, Bruno Mars looking <laughs> about the snow beard thing. I'm about to just make him so ugly. Nah, I can't have an ugly character. Yo, this looks like a Assassin's Creed guy. Edward Kenway. Is that his name? Styles, they're kind of hard. I 
I guess this kind of looked like me when I had medium length hair, just without a beard. Maybe, maybe, maybe this is the move. Maybe, maybe this is the move. I'm really freaking annoyed, bro. What is this? Do I want to go with something tied up? Who's Willow Snap? Stay. Show yourself, Willow Snap. Oh my God. Oh, let's go, Brian. Bro, I'm. I I can't. They don't have the option for a beard in this game, and I'm really triggered. I can't. I can't do long hair and no beard. It's just not me. It's just not me. Do I wanna do I wanna go with this? It's Lucius Malfoy vibes. I'm kinda digging it. Hey Brian, that's my that's my bestie from Georgia, Bilal. Um He's a cool dude. He gets a lot of UTIs, but he's overall okay. I think this is the move. I think that's the move. Let's do it. Freckles and moles. Kidding below. You don't get UTIs. <laughs> I look kind of red. That's better. All right, bet, Brent. Tune in whenever, man. I love you.
We fill in these glasses? What do we think about the glasses? No glasses? I think I'm I think I'm filling the glasses. Okay. What do I what do I wanna hmm? Hmm. Name my character. You already know, baby! You already know, baby! <laughs> huh. Is that the move? That's the move. That's the freaking move. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> the Law Potter, baby! Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spellcasting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well... I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Apollo <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful Let's go. Idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Not Any at all, baby. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Why do you make that face? For a second, I thought that was a glitch in the game, but then I realized uh, we're in Harry Potter land. Oh, oh, shadowy figure. <clears throat> Warner Brothers presents Harry Potter. And the down bad prince. The soundtrack, nice. Your traveling companion. My name's Blaw. New student. Blaw Khan. I mean, a Blaw Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary! It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get <coughs> a new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better man. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's, he's an intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen this? 
I have. Have you seen Alien Please? It differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. I'll take him. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. It's because I'm the chosen one, baby. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. Ayo, partners. Oh damn! He died. That was clever. That was cool. That was clever. The key. Give me your heart. It's the key to the basement. We need the key to beat Marley, bro. Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why? Absolutely. Let's see if we can Absolutely. find path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Is there a photo mode?
so dope. of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key. But I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This way. So, how was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. What is that, bro? a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. The quick we had a purse. Ah, right. Now it's just ahead. Steady yourself. their privacy. That poor key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Professor, 
This statue... This may have been his home! Professor! Professor, I have crippling depression! That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Like the goblin. Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, no way over here. <laughs> <clears throat> mm. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Hmm? Your wife's portkey. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. <whistles> After you. Inside the cars, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> How many votes are there? Oh, wow. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vote number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vote you see now in the next. Our private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power or both could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Like the glow you saw 
in the porky container. Now the darker. I saw that same glow in the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. The he watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. Damn it. Damn it. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Back. Oh no. Professor? was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Screw that up. Huh? Oh, I'm, I'm stupid. Okay. Go, 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 go.
Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Their jump scares. I not. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection's turning towards me. It does follow the light. Come on, baby. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Lumos. Where am I supposed to go? Revelli! What's happening? 
wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Let's go, baby. Chasing the bag, always. I need more friends in here. Okay. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Uh, go this way, come on. Okay. Rebellion. Lumos. Oh, I'm a big Potter boy. With their reflections. Oh, okay. No choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Let's do it. Woo, baby! Let's get it. Yeah, I read all the books. I'm a huge Potter guy. Come on, where'd he go? Hold triangle. Stupid boy, let's get it! Let's get it. Come on. Ah! Ah! Okay, let's get let's get back. Let's get back. Oh, boy. oh yeah. Hold up, I gotta change that one setting. I think I'm gonna toggle aim mode. No, I don't think that's what it is. Where, where, where is it? Where is it? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Are you calling me transphobic? Because you're absolutely right. What? This. I'm liking the combat. Game's really telling me I'm going too slow.
This is creepy. Lumos. <laughs> Narnia. It's not Narnia, silly. It's Harry Potter. None of Harry Potter or none of Narnia? I don't think what I've seen anything of Narnia. I don't know. But, but I Harry Potter, I'm a big Harry Potter guy. Basin. <coughs> that is no mere basin. That is a pensive. What? You've never seen Harry Potter? Memories. I wonder. The Harry Potter's the best, bro. Created. May be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability that to place. see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, <sighs> the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. And the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that William had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I Square was up. right. Square up! Ranrock. Seems Square up! Reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that... The instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, so I come. must insist. He's about to come. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. Damn. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were I we? have no patience for that I nose, bro. Ew. Mm. Well. Perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Professor Fig, you got no hands, bro. Well, 
What the hell? Everyone can see that, my friend. Okay. Okay, okay. Are you alright? Fine, sir. Yeah, I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed totally unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. I feel like we're gonna fight that thing later. To get to. Perhaps not now, Rula, but... Soon. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Edwin! Oh man, look at that. You have College of Dentistry, baby. of dentistry is the greatest of all time the greatest to ever do it oh good we haven't missed the sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate let's go now Let's go. I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must. When do I get to kill Malfoy? They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course. I got you. I got you. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? No, no, no. That's the Hogwarts uniform. He put him in uniform. You can have facial hair and I can't. I'm so pissed you can't have facial hair in this game. Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's really. That is a risky name. Nigellus? Nigellus Black? Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were. complications. Complications? It seems the goblin problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever the rumors I have left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. I swear they put me in Hufflepuff. All the quizzes tell me I'm Hufflepuff, and I don't want to be a goddamn Hufflepuff. I swear I get Hufflepuff! Professor Weasley, we've won more. Weasley, let's go. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Hello, I'm gonna kill you. Hufflepuff never did anything useful the entire series, except die. I swear, if you give me Hufflepuff, ah, you give me. Ah yes, a bit older than the others, aren't you? 
You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle. I'm saying, bro. Mm. Disrespectful as hell. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous <laughs> spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Nah, bro. I know about a cadaver. That's all I need to know. I wonder. Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of mm, what kind of looks it? like the chocolate snake girl from SpongeBob. Um, there. God, this is so obvious. I know what they're trying to do here. I know what they're trying to do here. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you Chocolate. possess a rare ability. What? Detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. No. I don't know if I'm trying to be a Slytherin. I'm definitely not no Gryffindor, bro. I'm the biggest pussy in the world. Hazardous creativity in a way. I've always. I'm not hardworking. I feel like I feel like I'm in between a Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw. But I don't want to be a goddamn Hufflepuff. I feel like I should do Hufflepuff because all the quizzes tell me I'm a Hufflepuff. I ain't no goddamn Slytherin, bro. I'm not hardworking, though. Screw it. Your loyalty to a friend delayed your arrival here this evening. Okay, let's see. Let's see his commentary on all of them. You've a ready mind, quick to learn. Possess a willingness to forge ahead alone when you must. Nah, hell no, that ain't me. I'm a. I um, detect a growing sense of ambition mm, and eagerness mm, for power. And you've a ready mind. Quick to learn. Screw it. Screw and it. Your Let's do it. To a friend delayed your arrival here this Let's evening. do it. I accept you. I accept who I am. Am I really a Hufflepuff? Am I really a freaking Hufflepuff? 
Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough! Quidditch is cancelled. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. I guess it looks good. To focus on your academic futures. If you say so, I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of work, but I'm sure that's never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. <laughs> now, here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff common room. This is hell. Indeed. A brewery? I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel, two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Hell Ga Huffle Puff. Wait, what? She said two from the bottom, what? Well done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Why, thank you. Wow. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. I'm really a freaking Hufflepuff. I'm really a freaking Hufflepuff. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop here. Gotta go. Pray Maghrib. And go to Rafi's place. Alright, my friends. It was a good time. Um, I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Assalamu alaikum.